small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. Now, how do voxels incorporate to the Witcher world? What they essentially are doing is whenever uh, you are far away from a tree, that tree takes a lot of resources to render all of that nanite technology, right? Because it's far away. So what they did is, is if a tree is far away, they turned that tree from a actual, you know, polygonal tree into a voxel tree. Just like in Minecraft, if you've seen uh, all of those Minecraft uh, kind of shader videos where it's like, uh, you know, cool Minecraft uh, clips and you look far away, right? Those forests, Minecraft forests look really good. And that's essentially what they are doing. If, if a tree or a shrub is really far away, they are essentially turning that tree or shrub into a voxel thing right a voxel build like in minecraft so that you can have a tree kilometers away without it taking up a huge load of resources and and the whole kind of graphical way they, they basically jerry rig these two technologies together and that is just the most awesome thing ever they are really doing things that a lot of companies just aren't doing they are taking the like rendering technology into the future like this is how modern games will be modern like uh for a long time i was very skeptical of modern games becoming really advanced and modern 